Hey guys, I'm Corey. Welcome to another episode of Zipper Tubing TV. Today we are going to talk about EMI shielding. What is it, how it works, and hopefully get you guys a better understanding about it. Frequencies come very, very low, and frequencies come very, very high. Now the lower the frequency is, the longer the wave is. So we don't need as sensitive of EMI shielding for that. It's a lot easier to shield. For the very high frequencies, we actually need something that's very solid, so we don't actually have any leakage through that. In terms of how we actually deal with electromagnetic interference, we have quite a few number of coverings to do that. We actually have knit mesh. These work very well for lower frequencies uh, and up into the mid-range frequency band. Uh, moving into a little bit mid-range and higher range protection, um, we have fabrics and cloths. This one right here is actually a metalized cloth that we use. Very flexible, very easy to wrap around wires, many applications, and it'll actually take a lot of cycles so it won't crack or break. Um, and then for the very high frequencies, we actually typically use solid metals like this foil here. Now the foils that we use, um, they have aluminum on one side and then a mylar coating on the back side. 